Howdy folks, Scott Grove here. Um, I have no idea what date it is. My camera don't tell me, so it's still February of 2014. Uh, this is, uh, as it says up here, uh, video number three of stuff that people are trading me for for my 170 hours worth of downloads. Okay, um, the reason I look as beautiful as I do today is, as usual, as most of you know, I'm going to kick the bucket at some time, which we all are, but I just did a little more of that today, so a good 18 hours in bed, and I'm up trying to get some work done, so, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, pity party. Uh, <laughs> so, don't be looking at my bits and pieces when I... <laughs> go down on my robe to show you the new stuff that came in today uh, real quickly catch up on some stuff um, I know a lot of people um, like or have been asking me to leave all the um, hate mail up on my very few videos that do have comments enabled so I have done that if you want to go yell at these people. I'm just going to leave the hate mail up for about a week before I block these people because some some people are vindictive. Not me! <laughs> but other people like to get the groovy army together and uh, go jump on these total douchebags. So, of course, the one where I did the little Jesus loves me uh, as, a, as a retard. Um, yeah, there's a couple Bible thumpers over there you can go yell at that are <laughs> of course, being Bible thumpers and judging people quicker than any other kind of person. So yeah, there's some of those over there for you. And oddly enough, all the rest of them are strictly on part two of this video where people sent me four things yesterday. So there's a bunch of them over there. I'm sure they're from the Chappers campus of what it seems like from um, what I've researched. They're all just coming over here because they don't like that people are sending me stuff. <laughs> It's not like I'm not giving anything in return. Okay, so I had two packages come in today, and um, all I can say is, holy cow. Um, I don't know who's getting the better end of the deal here, but uh, like I said, regardless, it's swapping. It's horse trading. It's whatever. So let's get to it, because I promised everybody I would keep you up to date on these. And, oh yeah, real quick. Um, you guys were mentioning that my 700th video just came up. That's because some guy, again, from Chapper's channel, um, had posted a video on his, on him and Lee's thing where they're trying to prove that tone wood makes a difference on that video. This one guy who made up a brand new channel and calls himself John Smith, so he just made it up three days ago and posted a video where he's trying to do a parody of me, and I put up a black screen with a link to it. Um, it's a good parody, you know, it's great. Guy looks like Eric Sanger, the drummer from KISS. If he just put a blonde wig on, he looks just like him. Um, but he did a great job. Uh, I know he meant to be offensive, but <laughs> sorry, he was funny as fuck. And uh, everybody's saying happy 700th video. Um, thank you. I've actually got 800 and some that I've posted, but other ones are just set to private now or unlisted. Just so you'll know, you know, so all the old videos on there, the narcissistic ones and a whole bunch of them that people just didn't like for whatever reason. So they're just m muted, basically, so you can't see them. So there are like 850 videos or something, but 700 showing. So thanks for the support on all the different videos. <laughs> okay, let's get to the show and tell, which is just beyond wacky it, that these two would be the two that show up today because they're similar in a way. Um, let's just say that, and let's get to showing you stuff. Okay, my first package came via UPS Ground, and um, Groovy Productions right there, I love it. Um, and I know I've got to, I've got to have my um, mail in here, so I know who it's exactly from. Okay, here's the business cards. Da -da -da. Oh, Peter. No, I'm not trying to be funny. It's Peter. Not for the Brady Bunch. Okay. Um, let's see. Over in New York. New York is where I'd rather stay. 
Ah, uh, I get allergic smelling hay. Hey, I got one of those. Uh, my most out of get tune guitar round. Yes, you too should have a Bigsby. <laughs> Hold on. A green acre did play for me. The farm living is a life for me. Her ass was spreading out so far and wide. Keep Manhattan, just give me that countryside. Oh, it's Vegas, I'm sorry. Gotta use the major seventh chord. Uh, anything outside of Vegas here. Okay, so we got Peter. I guess a Peter in New York. <laughs> Sorry, Pete. Gotta do it, buddy. Okay, so I can do this. Mm. Gotta rock hard, baby, all night. <laughs> Kiss. So there's Peter. <laughs> okay, if you guys really want to know who Peter is, how's this? I'll just do that. I'm going to do a plug. I don't mind doing plugs. There you go. There's Peter. Okay. So if I can get Peter a couple thousand views or so, I'm there, dude. And I'll send you guys, as both of you guys, your downloads here a little bit tonight. And so I got my two business cards. Plus... Oh yeah, um, hey, give Peter a shout, I don't care. Um, he don't. He probably don't mind the business either, so I'll gladly uh, promote anything anybody gets sends to me also. Doesn't bother me a bit. You got a business card or anything about it, any kind of swag, which is what I got today is swag, which you'll learn what swag is if you don't know. Um, it's just stuff to promote other stuff, you know, like, just like that with swag, but if it had a, maybe if it, maybe it was, was like a bumper sticker or something, or a t-shirt with all that on it, then it would be real swag. Kind of like, again, yes, the bumper sticker. Dun, da, 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 da. And I've actually been on this site a few times. All right. So, you guys go check Peter out here at Rock Hard Guitars. Okay? He's an attractive fellow. <laughs> and he's got his rich bitch right there. With a... Well, he's got a... At least I don't have the warlock, the widow headstock. Okay, what else I get? I got a bag of swag. Bag of swag. And I love it. And they're Tortex picks. God, how do you get all this stuff on here, dude? He gets it all on there. Let me wait for my camera to... I'll tell you about it on my camera in a second. Let me get your website there to focus in. There you go. Um, but yeah, a handful of them. Um, yeah, I ordered my 1080p camera, high def, high everything, great audio, blah, blah, blah. It came in yesterday and it went out today. You sent it back. What a piece of crap that thing was, Sony. It's their brand new, um, it's supposed to be for, um, actually for recording music and bands. That's what it's, they're not even out yet. They're getting ready to come out, um, next week. So if you actually were to go on to, which site was it? Um... One of the sites that sent you all an email a couple days ago that showed that camera. Anyway, I've already left the one star feedback thing and told them just how horrible that camera is. Piece of crap. Piece of oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Okay, also from Peter. Extra large shirts, he asked. There you go. Big ass t shirt for a big ass Dr. Groovy. And you can go check out the. Right here. And that's just the front. Here's the back of the shirt. 
awesome stuff and in my color of course um, let's see da, 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 da. playing all your favorite rock music again how cool huh steel horse this is real swag right here and I will wear anything you send um, on videos where I'm doing other stuff and you name I mean I wear stuff because I'm proud of it you know so I'm more than proud to like I said accept anything from you folks it doesn't matter if it's all this kind of stuff or the letters I've been getting or the coins or whatever I'm just loving horse trading and that's it no we're not even near done uh, Peter hooked me up hook me up with some Peter <laughs> sorry Pete hey it's the band still I mean how cool I mean major major splattage look at that face only a mother could love there you go. let me get the website in there and the back mm. okay Gene Simmons was this way there was always a battle between Gene and Ronnie James Dio. Dio did the devil horns. Gene just stuck out his tongue with it. Hey! <laughs> so that's the difference. You know, they kept having a big battle till, even till Dio died. Dio did this, man. You know, the old devil horns thing. Gene does this. What it was, if anybody gives a rat's ass about that part, but I pretend to know everything, so I'll tell you what it was. Gene being a person who plays bass, not necessarily a bass player, but a person who plays bass is a person who plays bass with a pick. And if you'll ever notice, you'll always see that he has the lycra, it's a material, folks, that goes down and around his hands to keep his outfit on. And it would go around between his two middle fingers so that he was left with this, okay, and so he could still play. But since he held his pick, he does the same thing exactly that I do, is when I go to palm my pick, and if I were to play with my fingers, which I do 90% of the time, you palm your pick with those two fingers, and then you're stuck playing with these three. Well, Gene don't play that way, he just puts up his hand like that, so it ends up with this, and that's how he came up with that. He just went to wave at everybody, and he was just holding his pick. So he didn't come up with anything, he's not brilliant in that sense. He's brilliant in many ways, Yes, he's money hungry, but so, you know, good for him. He came to America and got the American dream. God love him for it. Um, who care? I mean, why fault the guy? Good God, I'd be, I'd be in his shoes. Uh, so that's where that came from, the pick. So he just stuck that up in the air. Dio saw it and was like, "Quit doing my shit." It's like I'm not doing anything. It's like, then Gene started thinking, "Hey, that is pretty clever." But he just added the thumb because he did it on accident. Somebody took a picture. That's how it came about. I know I'll hear from Gene soon, but that's why I did this. That's why I went through that whole thing. Because that's on the back of the Steel Horse shirt. Again, playing all your... There you go. Hey, Long Beach. Ain't that that song there by Blake Shelton? Long Beach. <laughs> no, some beach. Okay, now we got three more things from Peter still. I want to make sure Peter's box is empty. Yes, it is. Yep, yeah, UPS brought me this today. And I was crashed and crashed and crashed and... Did I mention crashed? Um, and I have his music too. And then some. Mmm. Check it. I'm sure you can go get yours at the website. 22 songs on here, people. 22. Check this out. <laughs> Everybody stick your tongue out. There you go. 22 flipping tunes. Um, I'm going to put contact information, everything on here. If you want to check it out, check out Peter's stuff. Check out Peter's Peter. Ain't no Peter hiding behind there, I don't think. So I get to jam to some music. 
and some more music. Okay, so, Peter, man, thanks for hooking me up, and I'm not even done yet. I got one more to go after this. <laughs> A dog named Mitty. Musical Instrument Direct Interface, in case you want to know what MIDI stands for. And this one's actually from 12 years ago. There's Pete on the back. I'm guessing that's going to be him. And <sighs> funked up, seven, nine, smoking the pipe, full of yourself. I would never write a song about that. Doing my thing. <laughs> Customer service, I like that. Just some dude. Man, he, he's writing my songs. Let me see what we else we got. Uh, yeah, I make these as long as I want, folks. Everybody quit writing to my ass and saying, quit making long videos. Make them shorter. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm not making short videos. Um, they're like, it takes you forever to get to the point. So, what, do I, what else do I have to do? I don't care what else you have to do. Some people like to hang out with me for a while. Do I? Because it's fun and the Olympics are on. Who wants to watch that? Not me, anyway. Hung like a thimble. <laughs> Looking for my sister, three ways in a chair. <laughs> oh, three weeks in a chair, sorry. <laughs> Having a three way in a hair. A uh, three way in a chair. The next song's called A Hairy as a Peach. <laughs> it smells like tuna. Eat what you wanna. <laughs> Holy shit, Pete, this is great. Leaning Tower of Pisa. Uh, acupuncture. Lump on her chest. Wow, dude, man, I gotta li I gotta listen to this stuff. <laughs> man, <laughs> my boyfriend's clogged. <laughs> Fuck, dude. <laughs> um, yeah, check out these titles and how they're put together. Just great stuff. Yeah, you can. Yeah, screw it. I ain't got like I said. I ain't got nowhere to go. This will probably be damn near a half hour for just these two guys. And this is from 2002. A handful of Peter. You guys ever see that on Family Guy? When him and Lois got all um, tripping on LSD and they called their band Handful of Peter. And I got a DVD. Let me see what we got here. Um, oh, Zebra. Duh. That's why it would be. Or. As chappers and the captain would say, Zebra. Okay. Uh, when, when is this from? 2007. Very cool, dude. Yes, sealed. So, there's Peter's contribution for his downloads. Holy, I mean, I, mean, I, I am swagged. Big time. Everybody's holding their uh, smartphones up to get the... UPC code and check it out. And, hey, they were all on Peter's DVDs too. Here you go. Check it out. See what it's about. Everybody get up to their camera or their whatever's and scan it. There you go. And the other one. Dude, where's your where's your car barcode? Okay, you, you can't scan the uh, my boyfriend's clogged. <laughs> Got a clogged log. Okay, so there's. Thank you, Peter, man. That's awesome of you. And I'll get back on your site, and I'll be emailing your um, 170 plus hours worth of fantastic videos tonight, dude. Really appreciate it. Okay, and I know I'll see you here on YouTube like we always do. But and I will be playing with my picks too. So don't think they're just going to sit around. None, none of this stuff just sits around. I actually uh, last night did get to play with all the money and my um, big. Magnifying glass that I usually use for exactly what you're thinking of. <laughs> you notice how I'm not taking the camera down today. Uh, again, I'm not wearing any clothing, and you don't need to envision that. I got a handwritten letter again today. Okay, this is from Harry, um, and he says all the swag stuff, um, which I've read earlier today. Um, he's in a Ramones tribute band, which is very cool. Ramones. Hey, I know you always got to go to the hey ho, let's go thing. Um, which I will show you his swag from his group, which I got more shirts and more swag. Um, but it's great. And he hooked me right up. Um, 
Du, 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 du. Okay, he's telling me about the uh, through the wormhole by Mormon Mormon <laughs> Morgan Freeman uh, show on the Science Channel that he thinks I would like, so I'll check it out. Um, how it's made uh, is another show on the channel he wants me to check out. Oh yeah, and he sent me some flipping. Oh buddy, he knows the way to my heart. Uh, some chocolates from his hometown, and he's been doing his listening on my 23 hour long videos in 23 parts of Ask Scott Groove Anything, which I wish we could do again if, you know, these assholes would leave us alone, but who knows, we'll see. Um, he's coming to Vegas in July, and we'll, ha we'll hang out. So, yeah. So this is Harry uh, from Wisconsin. You're, it's cold up there, dude. <laughs> He's like, no shit. Uh, <laughs> he said, uh, this handwriter stuff sucks. <laughs> so for him to have to actually handwrite something, yeah, I know it sucks, but he did it. So fucking thanks, man. If, if, if nothing else showed up but this, of course you still get the same deal. But thanks so much, man. I, I pre appreciate this, and I will tell you, I won't read the whole letter. I'll just show you the rest of the swag. So I'm gonna get my. I gotta keep this out so I can send him his things. Um, the band Harry's in the Ramones tribute band is called Sedated. I wanna be sedated. You know, we you can't do it without. Um, first of all, let's see if I can do this behind my hand to get some contrast. So, yeah, I'll tribute to the Ramones. Swag. How groovy, huh? Um, I'm sorry, it's Larry. Duh, my bad. And I know this because he spells it with like 3,000 R's. I keep saying Harry. As you can tell, my bad, Larry. Um, I'm reading it backwards in the thing here. It's like, where's his damn name? <laughs> There's Larry. Right there. Larry. Remember when, uh, you guys will probably watch the same show. I watch um, True TV all day, so I'm watching the Impractical Jokers, and one guy's always going around, look at Larry! <laughs> it's great shit. Oh, don't let these fall out. I had these all in my um, shot glass. And again, swag picks. Let me pick something nice and bright. The band logo on Tortex Picks. Which I love. So, again, let me do this and do it right. Um, focus. There you go. And again, Larry, not Harry Larry. I'm sure he's been called that a few times. And a white one. Ooh, I like the white. That'll go with my custom Iceman. I can play it with that one. I'm all about accessorizing. As you can tell today, yeah. So those go back in my shot glass. I'm going to put those right up here so I don't lose them. Just felt like more bell. Yes, there's a cowbell up here, but the wife's asleep. So, okay. Swag time. From the band. Some more t-shirt from the band. We need a website on here, Lair. That's great. I love if you get. I hadn't seen it before it got really big, but the eagle. I can't see, so I'll just hope you do. Says, hey, ho, let's go. Coming out of the banner out of his mouth. So I can't see what's on the camera, but I'm sure you saw it. Awesome, dude. Larry, you rock. Peter, you rock. There's, I'm not done with Larry either. Man, I, I got hooked up large today. My wife's like, you gotta make room somewhere in that closet for your shirts. Like, I know. I'll clean everything out, not a problem. <laughs> and black is beautiful. Check it out. Okay. Look at this. How flippin' cool. Which is why you saw their logo the way it was done. For those of you who don't bother Ramones. That is too cool, man. 
And there's the hey, ho. That's cool. Love it. Okay. So here, um, he's talking about back in the hometown. The local chocolate company. Yes. On a Valentine's Day. That is what today is. Shit. I probably should have got the wife something. Anyway. <laughs> I'll get her up in the morning and say, Hey, I forgot to give you your chocolates, honey. <laughs> no, I'm going to eat these myself. Um, there you go. Chocolate for Scotty. Get me a little fatter. Hell yeah. And a sack full of these melty things. There you go. The Oaks Melty Bar. How is that? Mm-mm-mm. Hey, there you go. Smartphone people. From Wisconsin right there. Bam. Look them up. Again. Bam. Look up. Oaks smartphone. So I got a bag full of these things. I told you he knows, knows the way to my heart. Was he even done yet? Nope. Almost. But not quite. Um, he listened. Um, one of my, again, back in the videos when I was, people were asking me what my favorite thing was in the whole world as far as food goes and what my favorite desserts were and whatever, blah, blah, blah. So, so far he's got me hooked up on chocolates. But look, I, t I said my favorite Dessert of all time is the Hawaiian Blizzard from Dairy Queen. $10 Blizzard Dairy Queen card right there. And then my wife went and looked today and she's got a two for one Dairy Queen coupon. So we can both go have a great big super sized, you know, like bucket of KFC, you know, 20 piece sized Hawaiian Blizzards because they sent me a $10 gift card for DQ. And we actually have a DQ here in town. It's inside of a um, gas station, but it does exist. So, holy hell! And then I, I, I've been, I've been good. I've been wanting to s s suck these all day, and I'm not going to until right after this video, as I'm uploading it. My other weakness, and this is the last thing here from Larry, the real Tootsie Pops. <laughs> These are the big ones. We can't get those out here at all. My wife's like, holy shit, look how big Larry's stuff is. It's like, he knows that. But not one, not two bags, not three, but four whole bags with purple ones. I love them purple ones. And none of them weird blue ones and the banana ones, they're gone. They're not in here. It's just like, you know, taking out the brown M&Ms. It's like beautiful. So both of you guys, Peter, Larry... Uh, swag city and I'm going to go <laughs> rot, my, uh, rot my teeth out uh, actually I don't rot my teeth out if anybody has ever watched my videos from the beginning you'll see that I had rotted teeth and I had not that you give a shit a big space between these and I had to go my initial run in was four grand but during the first few videos I went and had because my mouth basically just fucking exploded when I was laying in bed one day and it literally looked like I woke up and got shot in the face with just blood everywhere. So I had to go get like four root canals the first day and all kinds of other stuff and then a bunch of um, crowns and junk stuck in. But these are perfect. People are always saying I got fucked up stuff. Man, my teeth are as perfect as they get. I go all the time to the dentist where I never did in my life until, um, what, four or five years ago? So you can go back and look at the old videos and then I'm wearing the man braces for a whole year of videos and you can watch that. So now I got a lady I pay over there that fixes my teeth every single um, three months and we doctor them up however we have to, but I ain't giving up my Tootsie Pops, I ain't giving up my blizzards, I ain't giving up my chocolates. And I ain't giving up this stuff. This is too much fun. So again, everybody out there, thanks for sticking for... I knew it would be a half hour. God damn it. That guy that made the new video that tries to act like me, that calls himself, what is it, John Smith? <laughs> Man, you gotta make your videos longer, you fuck. <laughs> okay, if you're gonna make a Scott Grove tribute video, or a tribute, a slam video, like the other people been telling you, you gotta make it long, motherfucker. You gotta do it right. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just cuss and hope to get away with it and just make some dorky southern 
accent every now and then. He calls himself something Scooby instead of Dr. Groovy. But he is a funny motherfucker, though. Uh, I wish he'd be nice to me and actually, uh, it'd be fun to do some videos with him. That would be fucking funny as hell. But I'm going to go eat this bag right now while I upload um, Peter and Larry's videos and, or upload this, upload this video and I'm going to eat suckers and send them guys their downloads and you rock. I'm going to keep this out because tomorrow I have a date with my wife to actually go out and get our blizzards and they were going um, walking again for our, our few mile hike we try to do whenever I can handle it. So okay, it's been 31 minutes. So you guys be groovy. Again, anybody that wants to just trade junk for my downloads, uh, all the information's below here. And um, uh, it tells you exactly what to do. Exactly. And then it lists everything you get. If you hit where it says show more down here, it shows you all 86 things that you're getting on the downloads. Um, if it doesn't say how long it is, it's a one hour video. Uh, anything other than that, if it says it's four and a half hours, it's four and a half hours. And for each video you download, or yeah, that you download, if it's an hour long video with normal DSL speeds, it will take you an hour to download it. So these four and a half hour videos, yep, it's going to take you four and a half hours to download it. If you have the T1 service cable, if you have like a cable um, modem, you can get all of these downloaded in under two hours. All all of them. You can, you, and you can download more than one at a time. Don't waste your whole time. Um, there's a link, for God's sake, in these videos I send you. And you don't have to just download one at a time. You can download them all at one time. And it tells you how to keep your um, computer from timing out all the time. And so forth. I got two whole websites devoted to strictly how to download all these. And it's in the link that I send to you when you go to download them. So if you have any trouble, check out the link there. And I've got I get probably 200 emails a day. My download ain't doing right. It's like, well, read. <laughs> okay, just, so just to let you know, again, anybody wants to send me anything, I don't care if it's a, if you blew your nose on a handkerchief and it looks like Jay Leno or whatever, it looks like Jesus on a cracker, whatever. Just get a hold of me and blow all the instructions. If you click the links below the video where it says show more, click that. It tells you everything you need. Write to me, Groovy, there's no E, G-R-O-O-V-Y, Lessons, at A-O-L. Yes, somebody still uses it, and it's me. And go back and fight those fuckers that are on part two of this. Um, there's some real assholes over there for everybody who says, hey, we want to go to bat for you. You know, the Groovy Army wants to assemble and beat the fuck out of these haters. So you can go there, that, there's some there, and then again where I did the uh, I'm Going to Hell video a couple days ago where I sang Jesus Loves Me uh, as a Mormon. <laughs> okay, so if you want the people to whip, they're in there. I left them for you to beat them up. I didn't block them yet. I didn't erase them yet. I'm going to leave them up for a week so you can go beat the fuck out of them if that's what you want to do. Okay, before I get to. So, have fun, and uh, catch you on the next one. So, this was part three. Going to Mr. Peter and then Mr. Larry from New York and Wisconsin. All right. Guys, be groovy. And Dr. Groovy, out. <laughs> See you, kids. Bye-bye.